Hello, and welcome to episode number six. Uh, I think I got the right one. This, Yep, yeah, this is the right one. Okay, so um, this is Backspacer57 again. Um, so the last episode, I haven't really done much since then, obviously. You can see the hotbar is pretty similar. Um, I'm kind of streaming this really close to the other one, just to kind of give you the heads up. Um, it's not that I don't want to give effort, it's just that I have content. It's going to be busy in the next day or so, so I want to get some um, episodes out here. That say, being said, um, we're going to explore, we're going to first use our new drying racks. So I crafted these. I play a ton of Minecraft. I watch quite a few spotlights and stuff. Almost n very, very few people end up using the actual these actually in-game sometimes. Drying racks are awesome. You throw some rotten fresh on it, you can do some zombie jerky. It's a lifesaver. So then all of this actually goes into the food drawer because it's useful as food now, which is great. Um, did I put that up there? I guess I put snowballs up there, though. Um, let's see. What else can go in here? You probably... Right. Um, I think we're going to need some of you to be burned into some stone. Uh, you just go in there, and you go in there. Right. So, um... So today, 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 today. Uh, so what are we going to go over? So we're going to go over how to make a gravel generator. Um, we're going to do it um, sky factory style. So for those of you who are build quarter, build, ah, who are uh, mod sauce fanatics, never want to play sky black in your life, this is going to be new for you. Um, however, um, those of you who have played sky black, who have meandered into it, you'll probably recognize it. Um, so it's not going to be entirely too new to you. Let's see here. And... We're not going to bother with the hemp yet. Let's see here. Okay, so. Um, that's fine. So I'll throw that up there. Grab all you. Okay, so to get what we want I'd appreciate some food actually can I eat these I can I can eat quite a few of these too oh this is going to take forever right so ah darn it so to get to um, the cobble gen process what we need is we need lava, a transfer node, and um, a, a chest, basically. So we have a transfer node, and we need an upgrade for that transfer node now. You see, I've been searching for coins. So um, we, we're going to look for is the world interaction upgrade. So this is actually four lapis, one iron pickaxe, and uh, for iron itself. So we'll need some lapis. You're kidding me. We have three. Right, so today we're going to be taking a detour into the uh, wonderful world of... Um, Minecraft. Let's see here. We'll take two of you, throw you into sticks. 16 sticks, right? 18 sticks. State Sean Connery style sticks. And uh, sneak into the world here. So, we'll be going on a brief adventure here to look for some quick lapis lazuli. Um, so, how do we get there? Well, first of all, we need to find a way underground. So, to find a way underground, we look for a hole. This is a chunk hole. That is not the, what we're looking for. So, to find a good hole, you must venture far and wide, apparently. Here's a good hole. Aha! Hole! 
Let's see. Oh. Well, this is new. Alright. So apparently... Diamond Staff... Oh. This appears to light up the cave around me. Well, nonetheless, we can put some stuff and things behind us to kind of let us know what way we came from. Uh, we don't need that, so we're not going to pick, pick it up. Uh, so let's see here. Let's see. Uh, don't need that now, so it's not going to be a big deal. Some osmium ore. Don't need that right now either. Well, you know what? We never. We can. You never know. Great thing about mechanism is no requirements on pickaxes. However, there are requirements on that stuff, so we're not gonna mess with it. See, oh, 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 okay, yep, let's see here. Supposedly this, or the staff of prospecting is supposed to give us extra drops. Um, so apparently it can be used to pick up stuff. has durability as well, apparently. Huh. Iron pickaxe. We have an iron pickaxe. Let's see here. I totally am aware that that's not the right pickaxe you see either. So, this is kind of a dead end. Um, we can get out of here easily. We can get some more iron. I'm only going to stop and grab this iron because we will need it eventually. And it's kind of a pain to find, apparently, in the actual world. So... Um, However, this copper ore is so common here. Let's see here. And up, upsie daisy. Some fossil ore. And out we go. So let's see here. Where's, there's home. So apparently you guys drop quite a bit of stuff with their sheep. I do not have a sheep. There's also lava. So yeah, that that, that spawns in this world too. Uh, you guys probably should have explored well by now. Let's see here. Illusionary black, illusionary black. Now covered in my blood. Alright, so... Let's see, we're gonna grab you, we're gonna throw you there, put you up here, and ah, there's nothing up here, either there or I've already been here. There is something here. We will be using some limestone to get across this impenetrable barrier, though. Is 
Sheesh. There's nothing here either. Ugh. This was a waste of time. I don't even know why I came into this thing. Probably because I thought Lapis Lazuli would be in it. But that's really all I need, too. Alright, last try. Totally didn't mean to the same picture. Uh, if we don't find something in this next... If we don't find what we need um, in this next house thing... Um, I'm just gonna go and cut scene, and it'll be the first cut scene of the series, because I will learn how to do that. Um, ooh, chicken eggs. Chicken eggs, chicken eggs. Give me your eggs. This is... looks like quite the complex, actually. sword. So, red miniature heart, wood dagger of wrath. Item frame, lunar calendar, enchantment table. Some crazy... Paintings. Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap. Why is that all productive? <laughs> Refreshing diamond repairs others when held. Can I take it? No, I'm not allowed to take it. How do I get up farther? Oh, there it goes. Ah, I see. Ring of Ender Disjunction. Some gold itself. So we can actually put this in our bulbous inventory. Um, cracked stone bricks. Anti builder. Uh, no idea what that did. Um, haha! -ha. We are now successful in dismantling things that we probably should be able to dismantle. Case in point, anything in this building that I am probably just going to destroy now. Or not.
Huh. So there's anti milliner spread throughout, and we'll be able to find them eventually, I'm assuming. Uh, we can dig that. Ah, darn it. Is there? Yeah, there's one there. Okay. Um... I want I want that or you won't let me have it that's fine too guys can okay so we're gonna cut and yeah I'm just gonna pretend that didn't. so without further ado um, I have a hammer and a copper sword and an egg and some zombie jerky or monster jerky there was some anti building devices um out in the everywhere so um i took those out so now we can freely make cracked brick apparently uh, let's see here ah Nope, okay, apparently not. Um, so we're gonna go and head and delete this death point. Because we're going to be getting others very, very soon, apparently, possibly. Ah. Ah. Guard. Take that. How many of these are there? Sheesh. Concept the spawner shouldn't work. Uh, quickly. Fifty one. Okay, and got my prospecting thing. Um, throw that out. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, that, yeah. Okay, and, alright, done. No, okay. Um, yeah, so, don't need you. Don't need you. What else do I need? Don't need you, don't need you, don't need you, don't need you. Oh, oh, great. Wonderful. Um, so this strategy is going to be much less elegant. It's going to be called run in there, grab some stuff, and leave. Um, so let's see here. All right, we're going a little bit over oh, to the wrong direction. So let's see here.
Alright, getting close, getting close, getting close. Oh, she's just so far to run. Right. So next. To the death point. With a trusty hammer. So what I really want to do is I want to just like leave the spawner there. Because I'm going to come back with a diamond dolly at some point and grab it. Because that thing's sweet. It's a really good way of getting clay, and absolutely nothing else useful. Um, or it might just be a good experience grinder. So, um, yeah, that's what we're gonna go for. It looks like there's some kind of oil or something there. And so that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna devote the rest of this episode to running through spidey webs. And seeing a massive amount of them. get everything? Did I get everything? Probably not. Um, let's see. Throw you guys on. So we're just going to leave that. Okay, so... I promised a cobblestone generator. We're going to cut again. And... Yeah. So, without further ado... How to make... A cobble gen. So... We can dump in nothing. So we'll just dump in uh, everything over here that we can. Dump. I have accumulated stuff again. Lots of stuff. So what we're going to do is we're going to allow ourselves to get rid of stuff by making drawers for stuff. Or chests, rather. Because this is still chests. Um, let's see. Where can we put this chest? We'll put one there. And... One there. Okay. So we'll put you there, you there, you there. And you'll all go there. Okay, so next. We'll need you. And then, let's see here, we'll need you, and we have a stack full of iron, okay, alright, here we go. So, we'll need you, and so to make the upgrade, 
we need one, two, three of this. Lay this out. I think this is actually wrong. So we'll pull these out, and then we'll pull these in, and we get the more the, the mining upgrade. And okay, so next, now we need to um, grab. What do we need? We need you, and then we need two buckets. We need two buckets because we need a bucket for water and a bucket for lava. And then we'll make our lava gen. Where can we make it? Well, we need a pickaxe to dig a little bit. Give ourselves some digging inspiration. Or wherever I ended up putting it. It's in here. Okay. So, there it is. We have a stone pickaxe. Oh. Oh, wait, no. Okay, no idea why we have a stone pickaxe, but we'll use this one. Um, so, to get this going appropriately, we should... We have four of those. And basically what we're going to be doing... Is just kind of... A janky. It's more of a trick, really. It's not even a, anything special. So, let's grab some water. Some of that there. And. And then we'll grab that. just to be safe and see how we have millions of things to mine every single time we open a hole in the floor. Every time. I swear to God. And look at this. Copper ore. Iron ore. Sheesh. Good thing I had some blocks from this. Oh, or not. Okay, so we're going to need to go grab some blocks now, because apparently... This base is rich in resources. You know what? We're not going to care about that one. Okay, so the reason I did this is because um, lava will turn. I guess we will. La what lava will do is it'll turn to obsidian if exposed to water. And obviously, that's a bad thing for us. We we need is we need the obs um, the obsidian later, and not now. So what we want to do is we want to put our lava. We need lava, so we'll get lava. We want to put our lava there, and then that will put something like that there, and then we'll put. Our block of water. Oh, okay, or not. See, it works great in concept. So let's see here. Um, you go there. You go there. You go there. Aha. Okay, and then so you go there. So this is kind of janky in the respect that um, I could actually have put that somewhere else too. Let's see. 
in the respect that um, it's like super janky is the easiest way to, to describe it. I mean, look at this. I mean, I just pretty much late level eight. Why is that late level eight? Oh, whatever. That's still there. Okay. Yeah. So I I just kind of put a pipe in the ground and voila, lava. So world interaction upgrade pretty much makes it just like there's a pickaxe there. It's infinite. So then we may generate an infinite amount of cobblestone um, that can then go ahead and feed our hopper, uh, which is full of nothing at the moment so we'll put a whole bunch of you guys in there and um so then that will feed this and then well no that needs to go there and then we'll get a whole bunch of these guys and we can craft them like this and we can then go ahead and run over here and plunk these guys down like so. All right. And basically, boom. Boom shakalaka. Whole side of the wall done. And that's how you make a cobble generator and get killed several times by clay golems in the process. Um, thanks for tuning in. Um, come by soon watch again hit subscribe if you leave a like hit comments if you don't like it um please let me know give me some feedback let me know what's going on with the videos um also with this tall door that i have no idea how to deal with and um leave a like suggestions comments concerns Hope you guys liked the videos. Keep tuning in and uh, see you next time.